Hello again, this is uh, another review of another um, uh, another rifle barrel. Uh, I'm doing a before and after video for Hatch Out. This rifle, particular rifle, is an M&P 10 and it's by Smith & Wesson. It has about 2,500 rounds through it uh, and just like the other video or the other barrels I have been cleaning this regularly with hops and sweets but today I will try the patch out I want to see if I can get it cleaner than what it is now uh, now the barrel that you will see in just a minute the bore uh, it has been cleaned it has been oiled and it was sitting in the safe I want to say probably about 30 days so it hasn't been shot yet so you will see the video how it is and I will apply the patch out and I will post another video after the patch out so we are at the muzzle end now I'm pulling the scope back slowly and turning it around so you can see all the way around the bore. There are some fire crack marks all the way down the barrel. I've already seen it. Now again, I don't have that much experience. Um, in machining, actually no experience in machining. Or looking at different barrels. But they look like these marks, they look like machine marks. Because they're very uniform. But in any case, the purpose of this video is uh, is to see how patch out works. As you can see, it is relatively clean. And this is a bore scope um, camera that I picked up from Amazon. I think it was about 50 bucks. I will post the link to that camera as well. And for the price, it gives you really good quality picture. Again, this is on a Smith & Wesson M&P 10 308. It has about 2,500 rounds through it. Here's the gas port.
I will go ahead and leave uh, the patch out by Sharpshooter in here for about two hours, and then I'll do another video. See how Sharpshooter works. You should check out the other video that I have. Um, I did a test on a Ruger Precision Rifle. You guys should check that out and see the before and after video. Sharpshooter works really well. And Sharpshooter uh, patch out, I should say. It seems like they have a really good product. I'm really happy with it. There is no scrubbing involved. Here's the beginning. These are the lands right there. And again, if you have any comments on this that I can learn from, please make your comments below in the comment section. And I will post another video how this has turned out. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.